games or activities that parents can engage when it comes to their children can be classified on the basis of their age group. So during infancy, what we call less than one year of age, a child is able to perceive light to start with and thereafter he is able to have a range of vision up to one to two meters. So in that duration, how they can start is by taking a point source of light and introducing it into a dark room. They can bring any of these large colorful object and place the light source beneath it, ensuring that it is within half a meter to the infant's eyes. They can move it in horizontal direction up to 30 centimeters on either side. As they make it a habit after three months of age, the child will be able to follow it binocularly and it will be a conjugate movement. They can do it for the primary colors, red, green or yellow. As the baby grows further, what the baby will be able to appreciate are high contrast images as shown in this picture. So individual cutouts can be placed on the walls or close to the crib which the child can get used to and can identify. It will also help in maturing the visual system. Second activity that parents of children up to the age of two years can get engaged to is helping them identify facial emotions ranging from worried, happy, sad or the common ones that they come across. Another activity that they can involve is introducing them to a mirror. Children between one and a half to two years of age can be engaged in this particular activity where the parents teach them different type of emotions using colored emoticons or emojis. After two years of age, what we can engage them is showing a mirror, asking them to identify their own body parts and their facial parts that will help them develop vision and it will help in improving their visual understanding of their own selves. 